Hi guys, I'm Bloody Bamberpuff, Bloody Bamberpuff, and welcome to Vampire the Masquerade. And we are going to start with a new game, and I know which character we're going to have. We are going to be, uh, not Nosferatu, what's the name again? Um, La, go directly, yes. Yeah, Malkavians, uh, because he has a nipple piercing. Oh. No, but everybody else is going as the female, and I can see why. I'm not like that. <laughs> But uh, yeah, we're going with Malkavian because this is a real hard game and Malkavians and Nosferatos, uh, I'm going to show you, these guys, yeah, as you can tell, they uh, have to have uh, uh, the ability Im to be invincible and they and the Malkavians are the only guys who can be become invincible for a short time. And, uh, but, <laughs> and I love Malkavians because they're in the same, yeah. Malkims are known as lunatics, but because they have the ability of hearing insights. And uh, yeah, that's not much about that. So uh, wait, let's go. Satana. Bloody. Blah blah. Bloody. Bambi. Puffs. Alright. So, uh, we go with that. And what are we going to be specializing in? Farms of all kind. Yeah, I think we're. I want to be sneaking, sneak. Where can I sneak out stuff? Can I change you? But what will, what will happen there? Lock picking. But why? Well, and you obviously need sneaking. <laughs> yeah, we need that. And obfuscate. Yeah, that's uh, invisible, invisibility. There, yeah, I said it correctly. I hope. <laughs> Maybe not. So yeah, you. I think we guys are ready to go. Meh. I didn't. Well, excuse me, princess. I am so, so sorry. Hacking? Really? Okay. I believe we can go with that. Okay, now let's go, bitches. Wow, be careful with the glasses. <gasps> that scream. <laughs> I've only played an old version of this game, so this is uh, uh, the new... Uh, the up um, I'm trying to remember the name, sorry, I can't. Uh, well, this is the updated version, and uh, <laughs> it's nipple piercing, look at that shit. <laughs> it's so wrong. <laughs> oh god. Hi -ya! <laughs> that escalated quickly. <laughs> Good evening. My fellow kindred. My apologies for disrupting any business or interfering with prior engagements you may have had this evening. It's unfortunate that the affair that gathers us together tonight is a troubling one. We are here because the laws that bind our society, the laws that are the fabric of our existence, have been broken. As prince, I am within my rights to grant or deny the kindred of this city the privilege of siring. Many of you have come to me seeking permission and I have endorsed some of these requests. However, the accused that sits before you tonight was not refused permission. Indeed, my permission was never sought at all. They were caught shortly after the embrace of this child. It pains me to announce the sentence, as up to tonight I considered the accused a loyal and upstanding member of our organization. But as some of you may know, the penalty for this transgression is death. Know that I am no more adjudicator than I am a servant to the law that governs us all. Let tonight's proceedings serve as a reminder to our community that we must adhere to the code that binds our society, lest we endanger all of our blood. Forgive me. 
Let the penalty commence. I s that's awesome sword. I want that sword. Which well. leads to the fate of the ill-begotten progeny. Without a sire, most child are doomed <clears throat> to walk the earth never knowing their place, their responsibility, and most importantly, the laws they must obey. Therefore, I have decided that this is bullshit! He was going to kill us. He was so going to kill us if and change his mind. Would let me finish. As if I have decided to let this kindred live. They shall be instructed in the ways of our kind and be granted the same rights. Mm -hmm. Let no one say I am unsympathetic to the plights and causes of this community. I thank you all for attending these proceedings, and I hope their significance is not lost. Good evening. You guys saw that? He was so going to kill us, and then he changed his mind because of everyone else was uh, stood up and like, <laughs> this is bullshit. <gasps> or something, I don't know. Just my. <clears throat> Your sire, tragic, my apologies. <laughs> but you see, there is a strict code of conduct that all of us must, must, adhere to, if we wish to survive. I like how her dude she looks totally funny, but like, oh, you're laws. a sick man. They undermine the well-worn fabric of our centuries-old society. Understand my predicament. Nope. Allowing you to live makes me directly responsible for your subsequent behavior. So, what I'm offering is not generosity, but the opportunity to transcend the fate woven by your sire. This is your trial. Uh -huh. You will be brought to Santa Monica. There, you will meet an agent by the name of Mercurio. He will provide the details of your labor. I've shown you great clemency. Prove it was more than a wasted gesture, fledgling. Don't come back until you do. Good evening. And yet the reason why I cho choose chose this guy is because he looks so fucked up. All the all the vampires you can play as uh, in metal version are always looking clean, but this guy he looks so. Oh my god! I don't know. I didn't even. <laughs> what a scene, man! Who <laughs> we? Then they just plop you out here like a naked baby in the woods. <laughs> How about that? Ah, look, kiddo. It's probably a lot for you. Yeah. You guys can read it. Uh, the rain and of ages plots against a wash away revelation. Yeah, they're m m That's totally m mind fucked. <laughs> what? Oh, man. And you're a goddamn Malkavian, too. Damn wow. right. You really are fucked. Thank you very much. Who is this dark demon I see before me? Ha <laughs> ha. I'm Jack. Yeah. What's important is I'm offering help. Really? You make it back from Santa Monica with your hide and we'll trade life stories, okay? Sweet. Until then, I got about this much time to wait around. Sir man, I am... I'm out because I know how to play this game. Yeah, I have played it before. So, uh, I'm going to spare you guys uh, not to go through uh, the tutorial. See, I didn't understand the play the game. Break down for me the bare bone basic. I need no path. I need no guide on this dark path. Leave me. Dun -dun -dun. Youngsters these days. Well, your funeral, kiddo. Jack is actually one of my favorite characters in this game. He's so chill out. He's totally mad, and but he still has his feet on the earth. He totally know what he's doing. I. He's awesome. Just so sorry. I have to be. I have to be mean. <laughs> Leave me a jack of the box for yeah. If you pull this off, come downtown to the last Thanks. round and I'll tell you how to jack this whole situation in. Until then, <laughs> good luck. Or maybe I should just say, uh, nice knowing you, kiddo. <laughs> <laughs> See what I mean? Ah, <laughs> oh, he's awesome. I'm no longer here. <laughs> Mr. Cross and Ranch, but Yeah, I didn't manage to read all that. Yeah, so okay, we'll go with this. Dun 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 dun. Very nice. I like the decoration here. <laughs> it's very beautiful. 
Uh, let's see, we have mail. Are you coming soon? Please come with the da. Please come with me in my downtown. Libby is scared. Dark blood across. Elizabeth, such power sounds young. Ah, Mr. Strauss. Tremere regent. Sweet. I can go with that. There. Thank you, Mercurio. The password can be sunrise. Thank you. Sweet. Mercurio will contact you when you arrive in Santa Monica. Waste no time in meeting him. Thank you. Uh, two. Damn, penis enlargement! Yay! <laughs> because I need that. Um, or maybe not. I don't think so, but uh, will this give virus to the computer? I don't even know. I'm done. I'm not even. Kilpatrick's prime puja. Looking for the lazy eyes. Okay, this is this guy. Um, look no further. Which also Kilpatrick's amazing prime puja? You can find almost anyone. I just leave you guys to read this, so um, yeah, you can pause the video, obviously. And we have a welcome, thank you, something more normal than uh, crime pewter or uh, penis enlargement. Come over to my place once you get situated and we'll talk about what you need to get the job done. I'm going to pick up explosives right now, some astrolytes. Ooh. I should be back by the time you come over. I'm at 24 Main Street in number 4. Walk to the end of the world. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, sweet. The opening. The game begins upon this mood. I, yeah, I'm, I've am i played this game for a while. I don't know if uh, for a while. <laughs> I've played this game uh, sometimes. And I actually don't know who it is who sent us those stuff. So I believe it's... Uh, there are some theories who it could be. Uh, I will wait, I will leave one here, just in case. We're going to get back here later, but uh, just in case. And uh, I, yeah, and if you also listen to the radio for you guys who want to play this or haven't played this, uh, if you listen closely, this guy is pretty much uh, talking about. There, there's a guy who talks about uh, the whole vampire society, but uh, the radio. Um, speaker, she's like, oh yeah, you really believe in that stuff. Oh, definitely, I believe you. <laughs> Not. And you can also hear something about uh, Cthulhu uh, if you really listen closely and uh, are have a great imagination. I believe you can check it, it all up on the internet. The internet is life. Well, that's wow. Ah, wait, <laughs> no. Oh, okay. Well, that's nice to know. Uh, yeah, my first. I just moved to this town and Carnival of Death. Uh, this is good to know. Uh, for all you guys who know, this is a little bit for who don't know. Uh, this is a little bit of a horror game. A little bit... Uh, much of an action game. Uh, sort of. So, I believe it works. Is this a mailbox? Okay. Let's go! Well, I might more blame aspects on that. Ba -ba 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 -ba. You, got, you got some change, mister? Sorry, I need it myself. <laughs> it's evil. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, I work here. I'm the fastest big pancake in the world, but I will not break for you. You cannot quench your thirst in the lone lock. Who could? Hmm. What should appear on the doorstop of my web but a nice, juicy fly? <laughs> so, yeah. Well, that means we're going to get our first drink. <laughs> yeah, better. Yeah, um, if you don't know, if you drain the person uh, totally dry, you will, let's see, no, wrong. Uh, you will hear humanity. Uh, it will get, you will violate the mask grade and that will, you will get closer to the beast inside you and you pretty much can't do shit about it. So, um, Maggots love you. Trust 